What does this mean for representative democracy worldwide? I mean, what what does this mean for wider Western civilization when the mother of parliamentary democracies tells its voters to sod off? <laughs> the British people have been betrayed and they are very angry. We saw it on the streets of London yesterday where there was uh, protests about the imprisonment of someone called Tommy Robinson. There's actually a pro President Trump demonstration as well, supporting him and welcoming him. And one of the unifying factors of many of these people uh, are that they are concerned and feel betrayed that the political elite in this country is ignoring them. And that is certainly happening. And these are actions which are supported by George Soros, uh, who has been funding the pro-EU campaign within the United Kingdom, even though he doesn't live in right. the UK, he doesn't pay tax in the UK. The he arrogance of vote the man in is the breathtaking. UK. But yeah. this individual, this shameless individual, who has a conviction in France for insider trading, has been funding the pro-Remain in the EU campaign in right. the UK. And there is a, an elite that doesn't care for the interests of ordinary working people, and right. it actually despises them in many, many cases and taking away their rights to govern themselves is why we had this referendum in the first place. And there are many people who are very, very angry. We have not successfully rolled back the frontiers of the state in Britain, only to see them reimposed at the European level, with the European superstate exercising a new dominance from Brussels. 